what? <laughs> All right, closer and closer to the set of two handbags where you pay $26 and two handbags come home to you. I'm wearing one now, um, and, but they're coming up next. Um, but let's talk about Geely. So our brand Geely is retiring, for those who do not know. Um, our latest creative director, Jill Martin, has a new line that she just launched this week, Bumba Bella. You're going to see it tomorrow night in my happy hour on Friday show. She's sticking with Lounge, which is really ultimately what you fell in love with from her Geely line. So I thought, you know, while we're transitioning and moving into Bumble Bella, you might want to check this out since this is what you have always loved from Jill Martin of the Today Show and her um, design career here at the Q. It's a knit wide leg pant. So you have an elastic waistband. You have a 29 and a half inch inseam. So some of us will wear this with like a cute little heel and a lot of us will wear it with slippers and sneakers. But they used to be $72. And now they are under $35. That saves us 37. I've got two great colors and they are so accurate. I feel like I don't even need to describe them to you. Navy. And it's true, true Navy. You grab that rose shirt coming up for $27 or wear it with a white or a gray t-shirt. You've got true navy. Personally, I love this color combo. Then this, this is our red. Let me bring it forward. I don't know what your screen at home is looking like, but I would say like flame red. I can see this around the holiday. I bought two Christmas trees today. <laughs> from QVC. Now, wait a minute. I did not spend like 800 on each tree. They're little tabletop trees. I want to put, we have, um, and my teammates have, might have seen this, but when you walk into the building right now, we have this darling little holiday display that our professional stylists put together. It looks like you're walking into somebody's house with like the little bedroom scene and the kitchen scene, and it's all highlighting some of our fabulous little holiday decor items. Well, the bedroom on the nightstand had this little tabletop tree that I fell in love with. And I've never put like a little tree on my nightstand at Christmas. I've seen people put big holiday trees in their master bedrooms, but I don't have the space or room for that. But I thought I do have room in my nightstand. So I got one for me and then one for like a, another little end table that I have in mind. So I have two little tiny trees coming home. Um, but anyway, this red, makes me think of holiday red. So trim the tree in this red, lounge around the holiday scene in this red. If there's any like better way I could describe it to you, I might say like flame red, because there is like a little bit of an orange undertone, but I really do mean just a little bit. Now fabric, this is all done in acrylic. So it's a little thicker. It's definitely a little bit more luxe. I don't want anyone to think for a second that this is like a thin knit where you could have worn this in the spring and summer. You would have roasted. You would have been too warm. You would have been able to like, you know, pass out of heat stroke. Like it's a thick, warm, sweatery knit ideal for fall and winter. And if I know our Jill Martin, newly married, she would have one of her Sherpa Cardis on with this, a sneaker, you know, take a walk on the beach in the fall and winter. For me, it's about like putting on that pant. And again, I'm getting things done during the day. And then I'm going to the bus stop and I'm taking clay to karate. And like, I just have these lounge clothes on that allow me to enjoy the loungy day. Although let's be honest, when you're a parent, let alone a working parent, your days off are not necessarily lounge, they're get things done, right? So I'm getting things done in my knit pant, but I'm also very effortless. And if like, you know, I see somebody I know, sure in my sneakers and a lounge pant, but one that I'm not embarrassed to be in. And let's, you know, let's talk about Suzanne. She's dressing this up. So if you do holidays at somebody's house or maybe your own house and you have people over and you're pouring the champagne and you know the fire is going and there's a island filled with delicious delectables, I don't know, bacon wrapped scallop sounds nice to me. Shrimp cocktail sounds nice. Maybe I'm a seafood app kind of gal with the Maryland girl that's in me. But whatever your little spread is, what if you did want to dress these up by all means? Feel free, but for $34.80, I mean, sleep in them, lounge in them, go to the movies in them. 
We have all those movie theaters now near us with those incredible um, lounge seats. Ours is called the Movie Tavern. I don't know if you have one near you, but gone are those days of like not being able to see the screen because you're 5'2" moa and there's a 6'2 gentleman in front of you and all the seats are all in one row now like we're lounging with our feet up i wear the most comfortable outfits now when steve and the kids and i go to the theaters i please don't judge or feel free to because i think it's human nature will bring socks if i'm not wearing socks with my shoes that day and I take off my shoes at the movie theater. My feet do not smell, people, I promise you. And I put my socks on, and I'll have my knit pants on, and you know there's a big old bucket of popcorn near me, and I get a big, large Diet Coke, and I just think this is like the movie theater pant, elastic waistband, tissues, although I haven't seen a movie that makes me cry in a long time, because now I see PG movies. Although, Sing 2. This mama, this mama cried at Sing 2. And Jen Cry too. I'm sorry for all of us who have ever seen Sing and then watched our kids fall in love with the characters. I personally, in my opinion, think Sing 2 was even better. And I cried happy tears and I cried laughing tears and it's just amazing, amazing. Yes, it is fun for all ages. Even my dad, who we call Poppy, was um, wanting 